What's up, guys? Welcome back to another Streamside Tied Up Tuesday. Today, we have, in my opinion, the most epic video that we have put out yet. So make sure you guys stay tuned. To start, Darnie's got a special fly that just crushed him today. And he's going to tie it in a really cool place. So I'm going to send you off to Darnie, and he's going to show you his fly. What's up, idiots? It's Darnie back at you here. We're on a beautiful stream here in Western North Carolina. We found this really peaceful place to tie. Come on inside. Let me show you what's been crushing them today. So, got the hook and the bead in the vise. Already got that bead locked in. Today, we are tying the hot tag France fly. And it's been crushing them. Let's get into it. All right, so now that you got your bead locked in, take your CDL. It's gonna take two, three fibers of that. I like to keep my tail skinny. Take that, line it up to about the length you want. You can adjust, make little adjustments if needed once that's tied down. Got that a little bit long. Shorten that up just a tad. And we are tying the hot tag on there, so you want to make sure you're able to see your tail under your hot tag. Keep that in mind. These little rocks, piece of broken glass, rusty nails, whatever you can find laying around to hold down your materials. So now we got that tail tied in. Gonna take a little bit of bright pink, glow bright floss. Cross. Call it what you want. Hey, call it what you want. I'm gonna call it frost. <laughs> Take one strand of that, not doubling this over or anything today. Just trim. Keeping a lot just to make it easy to work with. Wet that up just a little bit, keep it all together. And with that locked in, try and keep this on the top side of your hook above your tail. Trim it pretty short. I know a lot of y'all have had some questions about this. This is what I'm using for all of my France flies. It is the hairline micro body tubing. Tying that in, keep it tight, keep it thin. Just wrap that up. Lock it off right behind that bead. Maybe one more for good luck. Trim plane. And got some squirrel dubbing. Take a tiny little pinch of this. It's a lot. Take a lot of that out. Try and get out some of those bigger guard hairs. They just make it harder to wrap tight. And a couple of little wraps like, like that. Keep it tight to the bead as close as you can. Want to keep that collar thin and tight. Yeah, there it is. That is your hot tag France fly. All 
All right, not sure if you guys have ever heard of a Hot Tag France fly before because it was my first time hearing it just a couple months ago when Darnie showed it to me. I'm telling you, this fly is dynamite. Today we smashed them on it and we caught some of the biggest fish of our entire life. So make sure you guys stick around to see these clips of us catching fish on this Hot Tag France fly. He's terrified right now. Don't be, dude. Stop reeling him. Just let him, just yeah. let him work himself to the I'll surface. And we're in a good spot to net him. Oh my. Yeah, keep him It's cool to go up. Let him go up. Tire himself out. You good playing back? It does look pretty wild. Look at that, dude. This is the smallest brown I've ever caught. Eight your uh, France. Eight the France.
see that French fly in there. Yes, sir. Let's get that thing out. Ouch, dude. Let's get a release on him. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video of those behemoths. Dude, it was so sick. We had a time of our lives. We were dying laughing. It was just hysterical. Um, something we'll never forget. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We were excited to share it with you. If you guys liked it, please leave a like. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you guys want to see next. And then best of all, hit that subscribe button because it's our goal to reach 1,000 subscribers by June of this year. And we really need your help to do that. Appreciate you guys. Much love. And we'll see you next Tuesday at 8 p.m.